I'm here with head basketball coach of South Carolina, Frank Martin, and I know you've been outspoken about the flag. You did the editorials, and you handled the situation uh, great, I thought, with all your comments. Just talk about what it meant today, one, to see that flag come down and removed, and number two, that the NCAA has removed those sanctions, and now we can talk, talk about some postseason play here in Columbia and the state of South Carolina. Yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll answer your, your second part first. Uh, if you, you know, go backwards one year, Don Staley might have been in the Final Four two years in a row uh, if they didn't have to go out, to, you know, out west for 10 straight days to, uh, after being one of the top four seeds in the country. But, you know, it's uh, uh, everything uh, takes time and, and, and change is part of our life. And, um you know, and I, I couldn't be prouder of our state leaders. You know, Corey, I'm, 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 I'm adopted to the state, to the community. I'm new. I understand all that. Uh, and, uh, uh, you know, I just uh, I, I love what I've seen in our state. I think it's got unbelievable people. Uh, I think it's got tremendous love. I mean, the way that those families in Charleston handled uh, uh, such an incredible tragedy, uh, uh, just should show the world uh, just how special the people in our state are and, and the kind of love and resilience that, that our people have. And, uh, and uh, I, I thought it was time that, uh, uh, that we understand that, you know, the Confederate flag means a lot to a lot of people, uh, but it also means a lot of negativity to other folks. And uh, uh, I think it's, uh, it was just a matter of time that, uh, that uh, that flag went to a museum where it belongs and not stand tall and represent all the people when it causes pain to so many. And, and the fact that now uh, even Schwafford of the ACC talked about it, that they're looking forward now to be able to maybe have some, some bowl games, some NCAA games from an athletic standpoint, just uh, it's just refreshing. And, and, and you know, we kind of really can see what the state has missed out on. Absolutely, Corey. You know, it's uh, uh, you know, the Confederate flag is, is a fabric of the state of South Carolina. Uh, it's part of the history, uh, but we also have to understand that that our country has continued to grow and move forward. Uh, you know, and uh, not having the opportunities to have those kind of events in our state uh, deprive us of, of an economy, growth, uh, and different things that be great. Uh, to help us all build our programs within our state. Well, Coach, thank you so much. I know you're out recruiting and, and wishing you the best of luck out there on the road and looking forward to you coming back to this great state so uh, we can see your pretty face. <laughs> Appreciate it, Corey. I can't wait to get back myself.